What's up YouTube? How's it going? Right now, really quick before I get into what I what I want to get into in this video, I just want to show you guys that this video shows how it's totally possible to win matches against like these super broken characters so long as you learn how to adapt to the player, the way the player plays, and so long as I guess you're playing a character that's pretty decent. Unfortunately, I highly doubt like a character that's really low on the tier list could deal with the brokenness that is alien. But uh, Sonya Covert Ops is uh, fairly high, not broken, but fairly high so she can deal with it if she starts getting her pressure on. And more importantly, you have you have to be able to adapt to these guys because it's just, if you can't adapt, you're just going to get steamrolled. So now, what I wanted to get into with this video, I hope you guys all enjoy this by the way. Uh, while it says the ping is fairly low, I felt like I was lagging pretty like hard here. And so I was dropping a lot of combos. I don't know. It might have been just me because I was really rusty. I don't really play MKX that much, which is the topic that I want to get into about MKX. But yeah, I was dropping a bunch of combos. So basically what I want to ask you guys and what, what I'm thinking now is, are, are you guys bored of MKX at this point? The game came out in 2015, I believe. It's already about to be 2017 in a few months. And... I, I'm kind of bored. Like, I've, I've played MKX a lot. Like, a lot, a lot, a lot. I've played all of the Mortal Kombat X there is to play. Like, I've done Towers. I've done Story Mode twice. I went through Story Mode twice. I've, like, sat in the training mode for hours trying to learn characters. I've played a obscene amount of matches online. Like, I've done it. I've done MKX. And so I'm kind of, like, running out of, like, new, exciting, fun things to do for MKX. Fortunately for us, when it comes to new exciting things to do for MKX, there is a big patch coming out on Tuesday, and then Monday right before that, October 3rd, I believe it is, or October 2nd. I'm not sure when is Monday. I think Monday is October 3rd. On the 3rd, they're going to be doing like a Comcast, like a special cast with the creators of MKX, with Mortal Kombat, and talking about all their changes. Which to me means that, man, they're going to do some massive changes in this patch, you guys. Get ready for the craziest patch ever. Like, they're definitely going to change a lot of things. If they're going to do a Comcast specifically about this patch, that means that this patch is going to be massive. Also, it kind of says to me that this is probably going to be like the last patch. Injustice 2 is coming out in 2017, and it just feels so far away. The patch is going to be fun. It's going to make the game kind of new. But it's still like all the same characters, all the same moves and inputs. Like, I I've done these inputs, I've done these moves, I've played these characters. Like, I I've done it already, you guys. Like, it's it's still kind of not anything new. Like, these are the same characters, I've played them all. It's, it's not, like, refreshing. Even though you do change, like, the, I guess, the power struggle that is MKX, like the tier list and stuff. You do change that aspect of the game, it's still all the same characters. Like, it's it's no big, giant change in my opinion. Patches are very needed. Patches are what keeps people interested. Patches are what keeps the game kind of new, in a sense. But it's still, still kind of the same to me. It still feels kind of like, you know, just... It's, it's still MKX to me. Now, I want to know how you guys feel about all this, because I, I want to know your opinion. Are you bored of MKX? Like, have you played enough MKX? Has MKX tired you out? Like, you're like, well, you know, it's cool. They have a new patch coming out. That'll be cool. I'll play that for, like, another week or two, and then I'm kind of, like, done with Mortal Kombat. Like, I've done it. It's been almost two years now. And I feel like a life expectancy of a game that is, like, uh, multiplayer or revolves around multiplayer is really something like a year. Like, this game, while the story mode is fun, you finish the story mode in, like, six hours or less. And then you're, you're just done with it. Now it's time to play a bunch of matches online. And a game like that, I feel like they have a life expectancy of about a year. If they're not like constantly bringing out new things, like if it's not like constantly new characters or constantly new twists to the online or something like that, which you kind of can't do in a fighting game, you know, you need your online to be stable. You don't want people to get pissed. It's not like World of Warcraft, which by the way has a new expansion and I am super, super in love with. <laughs> It's, you know, it's, it is what it is. And I absolutely love Mortal Kombat, but I, I want to know what you guys feel. How, are you guys done with it? Like, have you played enough Mortal Kombat? Or is this the type of game like, oh, I can never get tired of Mortal Kombat. Like, I love Mortal Kombat. Like, for me, Call of Duty was like that for a very long time, where I could never get tired of playing Call of Duty online. But after a while, I, I got tired of it. Like, I'm tired of Call of Duty now. Like, I don't play Call of Duty online that much. 
Uh, I just recently started playing more MKX because I miss the game. It is a very fun game to play. Uh, don't misunderstand me to say that I think MKX is not fun. If you know anything about this channel, I absolutely love MKX and will continue to love MKX. But what I really want is Injustice 2. <laughs> Basically, this whole thing, this entire rant is me going, I want Injustice 2. <laughs> like, I want it already. I want to play it now. I absolutely loved Injustice 1. If anyone's ever played Injustice 1, it's such a good game. You know what I'm talking about. It's so much fun. And so I, I, I want Injustice 2. I want to play Injustice 2. I want to I want to experience new characters. I want to learn new combos. I want to experience new challenges. And that's what it's about to me. Playing these type of games are about experiencing a new challenge. Like I used to only play Call of Duty, but then it became less challenging. Then I switched to Halo. And then the creators just like totally killed the franchise. Now I'm at Mortal Kombat. So I'd like to know what you guys feel. How do you guys feel about the game? Are you bored or are you not? Be sure to let me know in the comments and I'll see you guys in the next video. Stay tuned.